All right, here's our very next race. It's already underway. This is what we knew was going to happen. They're going to start making up time on our schedule. So this is the 205 race. It's uh, 240. So we're about 30 minutes behind. We've got Edgewater in the red boat, Miami Rowing Club next to them, Hollywood A in the middle of the pack, First Coast in the white boat to the top, and Hillsboro out of Tampa in the black boat on the top of the screen. So five boats in this race as well. Edgewater in the red boat, and right next to them, Miami Rowing Club is in the lead with Oh, sorry, that might, actually our angle's a little askew right there, so I think actually uh, Hillsboro might be in the lead. Everybody very close, though, here, still inside the, they just crossed the 500 meter mark, so they're inside that middle 500. So this would be the um, top boats from Edgewater, Miami, Hollywood A, First Coast, and Hillsboro. That's the uh, winners from your first heat of second youth fours right there. That's Oars with Hollywood right next to them. Girls from Oars got to be feeling good about that comeback. It's probably in the game plan all along. All right, here we are back to live action. Hillsboro down at the bottom in the red with Miami Rowing Club, Hollywood right next to them, First Coast and then Hillsboro at the top. Hillsboro's got a little bit of a lead, and it looks to me like that would be Miami Rowing Club in second, but real close between them and Hollywood A. Very close. And, uh, oh, I love these views. This is my favorite view, having the crews coming at the camera. Maybe our camera operator can get right in that middle, right under, or right above lane uh, three. There we go. Oh yeah, this is the this is the money shot right here in rowing, in my opinion. Love to see the crews coming at the camera, having the camera fly behind or in front of the rowers. Absolutely fantastic, Dan and crew. Love that shot. Wonderful. Here's our side view. So obviously we've got two drones flying up there right now. This is a real deal, guys. So if you've never watched rowing uh, with drone video, this is, it doesn't get any better. Um, I've watched an awful lot of racing and this is fantastic production. So the organizers, you viewers, you supporters, um, fans, family, friends, moms, dads, brothers, sisters, grandmas, aunts, uncles, everybody, this is really, really good stuff. So be sure to thank the organizers, give them feedback so they know uh, that you like this and maybe it'll come back next year. All right, we do have in this race, Hollywood. Hollywood, um, slight lead here over Miami Rowing Club. I think that's your 500 meter mark to go and Edgewater is not giving up at all down there. Edgewater in the bright red boat looking really good. I think they're moving up into third and they may move into second if uh, if uh, Miami doesn't uh, make a little move right here. Miami's coming through the water a little slow. Hollywood looking good. I think Edgewater's starting to make a move right here. It's Hollywood up in the front in the middle of the course in lane three. You've got uh, First Coast just back, just out of a you know closed length down on, uh, on Hillsboro over there. And like I said, here comes Edgewater. Edgewater's looking really nice here coming through. They can take a couple more high end strokes, clean out. They're going to find it, and they do. Look at that. All right. Nicely done by Edgewater to come into second place. And uh, Hollywood, Miami Rowing Club in third, Hillsboro in fourth, and First Coast in fifth. Congratulations to the winner of Hollywood A. Great job to have all those ladies in that second four. Nice job. That was a great race. That was one of our tighter races there. And good job to Edgewater. Coaches, Coxon, great job. 
Coxon did a really nice job timing that, I think. So uh, she was a little lower, and then she knew when to when to bring the rating up, and saw the saw the uh, crew from from uh, Miami kind of falling back. 